I think I just avoided a death, yeah. I think. We don't have the, uh, the thing though, so what are we gonna do? Here? I don't know. I think. Yeah, I think we'll be all right here. Oh god, I'm gonna pause it. Maybe. Let's just see where we get. Oh, <gasps> it's curator time. Oh, hello. Hello. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Yes. Hmm. I want him to do a Sherlock Holmes game. That's what I want. This guy in mocap, just telling you your shit at everything. Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. Although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. <laughs> Let me help you out. Give you a little hint. Oh, mate. Go on, then. Go on, then. Let's see. Well, then. How can I put this? There may be forces at play here that are more scientific and even some that are more political, you know? That does not help. Supernatural. Perhaps you've started to realize something. <laughs> that everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. Uh, I hope that helps. No! No, it fucking doesn't. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? No. <laughs> Go on, back to it. No. Speak soon. No, sir. Please. Hey, before it's a gas leak. Yeah. Jesus. What the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some like, like evil, like literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, like there were these old soldiers and they were bodies they were dead but then they came alive and that doesn't sound that crazy right about now alex wasn't the only alex what are you talking about there were things walking around with his face on them alex's face it it was horrifying yep julia i'd never hurt you you know that right yeah, but no i know it's just this can't all be it's happening. only if you know i'm there Maybe like one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's gotta be something going on here. Okay, so yeah, there are there is an argument here when it's political and whatever he said, it could be a toxin thing, because we saw that stuff leak. That was something related to the electricity. It's Resident Evil 8, yes. It's out before they even announced it. Yeah, oh, maybe this is the new Resident Evil. Political and scientific, so yeah, bioweapon. Bear in mind, we know the Americans did use bioweapons. Uh, the Gulf War had a fuck ton of them. Uh, also, World War Two had a fuck ton of them. Uh, World War One literally had, was it mustard gas? That was so bad that they basically banned it from that point on. So there is a possibility that they're all tripping balls. That would fit with scientifically political. If it is a bioweapon that's been sitting on a fucking ship, um, there is an al there's also an argument, if it's like carbon monoxide or any of that shit, hallucinations, uh, there's an argument in a, quite a lot of like haunted houses where it's uh, like the pipes. <laughs> like it's in the gas from the pipes. If there's a gas leak, you're tripping. So it could be that, or it could be haunted entirely. It could be that, the curator is lying to us. That's the other thing. We have to take into account. We know Supermassive lie in their games. Sometimes, if it works for the narrative. And horror is one of those ones 
where you get a lot of fake deaths to the point that we're still not confident that Conrad is dead. He seems so trustworthy. I know. And that's the worst part, Kitty. I want him to read me stories too. But that's the point. That's the point is he is a horror host of, amongst many other reference points. You want him to tell you all the nasty shit. Doesn't necessarily mean he is the most trustworthy person in the world. Much like this lot are not trustworthy. It's also, yeah, religious sect, political organisation. Literally there was a dude with a fucking skull thing. So that's a, something to be taken into account. It, yeah. There's a lot of stuff. He is also, yeah, Alfred Hitchcock and his TV series, Alfred Hitchcock also did the hosting element. Um, so that that's the vibe they're coming from. Amongst many other things. Um, yeah. So I think I think there could be an argument there. But... It could also be a, an actual spoops. It could be either. I just don't know at this point. I don't know. Just... Uh. What can we absolutely be sure about? Nothing. What do we know that's real? Nothing. Uh, where's the gold? Yeah. Did you see the gold? Anything? It might be time to accept there's no gold here. Would have seen it by now. But then why is the ship cursed what happened to everybody on this ship where did they all go you can smell death everywhere it's like a tomb so where did all the corpses come from apparently getting scared to death is an actual thing because yeah. i'm pretty sure that's what happened to these guys yeah so is this a ghost ship <laughs> am i crazy or are we on a ghost ship i guess that's one way to look at it I know we're not the first people to see weird shit here. Apparently the guards were super freaked out by something they saw in the cargo holds. Yes. Yes, because we read that. So what is happening on the ship uh, is a very good question. What do you think actually happened to this place? Beats me, man. There was a note about a storm in the logbook. I guess they got caught in it. Yeah. We know more than we did before. And we know the electrical That's storm at least. melted something. Time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Mm-hmm. Hold on. The ship's gotta have a radio. Yeah, but it didn't work. If we, we can know find that. Anything, use it. That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. Like they physically couldn't get it to work back in the fifties. Also, Zemond and Angel Kitty Nikki, thank you very much for your resubs. Angel, I, it was during a scene, so I was like, nope, nope, we'll do it in a minute, and then we got distracted. But, yeah, it's... It's something that they were... We definitely know they were transporting something. We definitely know that it oozed, for want of a better explanation, and electricity happened, and other stuff. It, it Cthulhu's magic rock entirely, like, atomic-level nuclear shit could also be possible. We just don't... This is the problem. We don't know. And I, I doubt the curator as well, because... We gotta get off this damn ship. It... No shit. It could be that. Uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. It's like, how much do I trust him? He's so nice and so friendly. But does that mean that his excuses are real? Does that mean that he's basically making it more complicated? Are these shotgun shells? Motherfucker, what happened here? I know it sounds crazy, but... Maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. Oh, no, hang on. That's an anti... What, an anti-aircraft missile? Big fucking guns. Well, so what I would say in terms of the 1940s flashback right at the start, uh, pork chop, is that we saw one side of it. I played the other side of it in Germany and it's really fucking visceral. So it's, there's a weird discrepancy that actually is making me, I'm quite into playing this again anyway. I want to pick player B so I can show you the stuff that we can't see. Also, that's a fair point as well. We're in the open air right now. So the gas theory shouldn't stand up. Fair point, Dr. Crossfire. And we've got a radio on our own boat. Yeah, that's Great. another point. Can Why can't we just... They weren't Swiss cheese. 
Why can't we radio off of our boat? Because we don't have to go anywhere unless the distributor is needed for the engine which powers the radio, but probably not. There's a lot of things you guys are thinking of here, and I'm like, yep, no, that's a fair point. That's a fair point. It brings us, unfortunately, just brings us right back round to its ghosts. If, but, yes. Or just, like, we're fucked. Uh, but we know that their radio doesn't work because of the documentation that I read that they seem to have forgotten about. So, um, this feels like a bit of a waste of time, but... Uh, it may not... And that's the point as well, is if it's already in our system, that might be it as well. So the gas... It may not be a gas thing, but, it, yeah, it may be a chemical thing. Sadly, no, but... I'll keep my eyes open. As long as we don't all get decapitated on the deck by some fucking fishing wire, which is what happens in Ghost Ship the reboot, I'll be very happy. I knew it. I knew that was coming. Hello? I knew that was coming. What does this say? Gas mask instructions. Oh no! Don't put it back down. I was reading that. Motherfucker, please. Hang on. Go back in. I knew that was going to... Every time you open a thing, I'm like, I know there's going to be a jump spoop at some point. Which one? I'm glad that made you all jump. <laughs> uh, so, this is just the the, uh, the gas mask uh, guide. Arguably, this dude had a gas mask on and he still died? Also, he was hiding, and he still died with the gas mask on. Outside, as well. So if it is a biochemical thing, once it's in your system, you're done. He could have also had the gas in there. He could have been shoved in there. He probably ran out of air hiding. Who knows? Who knows? Also, if it is mustard gas and shit, you only need a couple of breaths and you're done. So, yeah. I love how we're now theorizing. It's like a help over here. we may never, we may never know the best horror games slash media. I think this is our way up. Two answers. Give me a lift. <sighs> I'll pull you up. <laughs> See you now. Have a good one. Au revoir. I've not had any French for ages, so there's some. My terrible attempt. If it never lets us know whether it's ghosts or science, that's great, because that's that's how like old school gothic horror is. It's like there's never a, a, a complete fixed answer. There's always a couple of readings you could have. No, dude, this way, this way, please. This is the way I want to see if there, oh shit, if there is anything here, or no, apparently not, we will leave. So yeah, there's, um, if you play as player B, slash the alternative playthrough, when you have that bit right at the start, oh fuck off, this is not good, you'll play as Joe instead of Charlie or vice versa, and there's literally a bit where you hide in a locker and a thing chases you. So I'm I'm of two minds regarding that dude back there who was hiding. Is he probably went? So I just don't know with that dude. It's dodgy the way. Uh, I just want to see what's down here. Oh, hang on, Fliss is here. Oh, uh, I'm gonna have a chat with Fliss. Maybe. Hello. Or not. Okay, I'll go back. Why can't it be a gothic romance on an old ship? I mean, we could try now. My fiancé is still here. The ring's gone, but the sentiment remains. Hello, my darling fiancé. How are you? No, she's not interested. Sorry. Where is Conrad? Probably dead. 
I had a small accident involving a ship and uh, some driving. Over here. God, I hope he, I really hope he comes back to save the day. Cause fuck me, I need somebody. Oh, shit me. Somebody to save the day. Uh, where's everyone else? Dude, where's everyone else? Oh, fuck a duck. Whoa! Hello, that's, that's, okay, no. Hello? Oh, shit off. <clears throat> okay. Titty shirt. Yep. We did get that titty shirt. Alright, show me the logbook. See so you going down thick fog. When's this? The SS Urang. Huh. Last log shows I'm caught in a storm. Yep. Yep. Yep, yep. Which we knew. There's way out there. Where the fuck has everyone gone? Oh, cock off. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Do you want me to go that way? Oh, here we go. Right, pay attention. Junior. Junior commits suicide. Who's Cannon? Junior! I don't want Junior to die. I'll give you, I, would, I don't really want any of the bad guys to die because I feel like, actually, if we're sensible... We could use them. You know, we could all team up and escape if you were being sensible about it, which you're not. Uh, hang on, it was that one. Loose cannon. Now that looks like him. That looks like he's doing it on his own. Hmm. I also don't really know where the fuck I'm going. Oh, hello. Oh! No, but there's gotta be a radio on this ship. My there, way. there has to be. I'm not exactly confident about our chances of survival at this point. No, I'm not either, frankly. What the fuck is that? Oh, it's the radio, I think. Um uh, oh. ship was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Okay, so hold two was flooded. Excessive lightning strikes. Adrift. Then at some point, like half an hour later, seabed depth believed uncharted. Search for sea member, sea member, crew member overboard. Commenced. Search called off after eight minutes. Heavy cloud cover. So they drifted. They drifted me away somewhere so we can go in here I don't really know what's in here this is probably oh the radio okay I'll come back to you let me go check every other room first no this way dude hello it's because the camera angle swapped but I was still walking so he continued to work uh, walk the way I was going oh the way I was going oh something's wrong here if you were headed to San Francisco you'd be crazy to take this route it's mm. almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? Yeah. Okay. It's almost like they were smuggling something. Yeah, they must have hated that dude. Eight minutes to die. I suppose if it was really fucking stormy and shit, and you can't see anything, you're not going to have a hope in hell. Uh, there's a... So, okay. Alright, so. He's looking at this one. 
Let's have a look. I'm going to regret this. That's closed. Thank God. I've seen it. No, I've seen it. That's the one I've seen, Jocko. That's the one with the... Uh... Oh, mate. No, I've done these bits. Okay, hang on. Let's go back. I think that's the painting we've done. Yeah, I circle back. So it's the one where it shows Junior shooting himself. The only reason we know he's Junior is because of the, the subtitles. Junior, Danny, Ol Osman? Olsen. Olsen? Not Osman. Richard Osman! So yeah, currently we're still going with like Cursed Gold something. Not entirely sure. This is still working, Take a look. which is insane. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as okay. long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Okay. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask him for help. You fucking wish, hey, mate. Hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? <gasps> Holy shit! We got him! Uh. If you can hear us. We're on a ship, an old freighter. It's a bad Our idea. Approximately uh, 12 degrees 30 minutes south, 151 degrees 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. Please repeat. Please repeat. Over. Uh, 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 yeah, sure. We're on this like old freighter. We think the name of it is the Iran Medan. Hello. Hello? Is anyone out there? Yep. Please, come in! It was haunted all along. There was no real radio. You honestly thought there was hey, power? Come here, look! We know the guy couldn't use the radio back in the 50s, let alone now. Ghost fucking radio, man. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. Maybe. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. Ha <laughs> ha! Obviously. Oh my god. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Uh, if you're sure you're up for it. Hey, if you're sure you're up for it, I believe you got it, bro. Yeah, bro. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect the guy. I can handle this. Trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Yeah. Case closed. Yeah, Alex. Hey, okay, Julia. It's you and I. Okay. So Fliss is staying with Alex. <laughs> great job. Fucking great job, both of you. had one job and you failed oh god is she out no she's okay brilliant now we're on the lower deck great any broken bones everything still work oh hello everyone okay we're okay we're okay what are we gonna do Jesus. we're gonna have to find oh. the generator if we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Okay, we'll wait here by the radio. Okay, I don't have much faith here. in... Oh. Thanks, mate. Thanks. I don't have much faith in these two. Like, the Fliss, the Fliss Alex team is something I'm more confident in than this. Arguably, hey. Alex isn't here. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm sure. Like that old thing. Hang on a bit. Actually, that's a fair point. If gas was a main thing... Actually, it would have to be flammable, surely. Is all gas flammable? No. If there was gas here, 
would we be able to light shit with a lighter? That's my big thing. After you. You know, depends on the gas. That's the problem. Also, you know, if it's it, like that, that might not even be there. We might be imagining this fucking torch. <laughs> yeah, not all gas are flammable. Yeah, as soon as I said it, I was like, shit. There goes that the theory. The oh, fuck. It's sick, bay. I hope you're ready for the nurse. Because... I don't want to deal with that. No, thank you, nurse. I don't want it. Oh, hello. Oh, medical officer's report. Minutes of meeting between Scientist X, Walter Bishop from Fringe. Well, that explains a lot. And Tom Palmer with Sergeant Peter Wood observing. Something, something. Western world must be protected from. The United States has been aware of certain agencies investigating chemical and biological weapons in warfare. Limited by Geneva Protocol. Uh, test the effects on human subjects of the molecular crystal structure hallucinogens code named Manchuria Gold. Even relatively minor amounts are observed to trigger significant hallucinations, which are highly convincing. The danger was manifold. There we go. So there's no gold. There's no Aztec gold. It's a fucking chemical that has been code named. Which again, not surprised, look up Gulf War Syndrome if you're interested in looking at actual like biological weapons and the damage they do to soldiers. Uh, or mustard gas, you know. So we know now that Manchurian gold potentially, again, if this is a real document, is a hallucinogenic biochemical weapon. That's fine, it means it's not ghosts, it means we're tripping balls. It also is why we never had a hallucination outside. Yes. Well, potentially. Was it meant to be deployed against uh, what it came... Some sort of altercation. Oh, shit. Yeah, well, uh, so they came from China. The ship starts in China, and they're coming back towards America. So, um, I'm not... I'm not sure. Um... It would also explain the alternative route taken, yeah, if they were trying to, like... Whoop. Uh, so Pri Private Charles Anderson, Charlie, did display intoxication in a manner not becoming a member of the US Army. Uh, so he was off the boat when initially it started. This is the dude who got... Um, arrested. Uh, so they were both returned to the ship. So that's that. Ten days. Ten wow. days. They never got to that point. really blown his lid to get that kind of time. No, I think the guy, the, the dude was just a bit salty. Uh, but yeah, the hallucinations cause the heart attacks, so they die in fright. Um, basically. Is what it seems to be suggesting. Uh, and then I guess rigor mortis. Oh my god, I forgot you were there and was like, what is that thing moving at me? Sorry, I just had a sore moment, Julia. Um... Yeah, so, uh, he did also say, yeah, not all that glisters is gold, didn't he, the curator? He might have been referring to the fucking Manchurian gold! And why are there cells in sickbay? I don't know, gotta make sure that they don't, you know. I, I suppose if you think about it, you're on a battleship, you may have prisoners of war, so you've gotta lock them up. <coughs> Maybe. Enjoy this. Oh what fuck! Hello. Well, in oh. any other circumstance. I can't. I can't go. Where am I going? This way. The oh, there. Explore, oh, like, like ever. I'm gonna say no. Not at all. Says the girl who couldn't wait to dive a wreck. Shut up. Shut up. Oh fuck. Sick bay time. Who's ready for sick bay? Oh. 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 Oh yeah. Literally, this is where we were at the start. Oh look, it is our son. Who stabbed us? Hmm. 
been the son of somebody on board. Regrets. Such regrets. What's this? Uh, John Patterson, private, mild neurosis, not the result of his own misconduct, and was incurred in the line of jute. Da, da, da. Uh, I observed signs of severe distress consistent with evidence of panic. Uh, I, I observed in the same soldier during his watch duty earlier this week. Uh, he believes, I believe his panic to be accompanied by vivid and disturbing memories. In the past, he's managed to contain his duties as symptoms appear to alleviate after his guard shift. Chemical. So, what might potentially be appearing as PTSD uh, to some of the, like, some of these guys who are having mild neurosis is just proximity to guarding the fucking gas, it seems. Brilliant. Oh, Jesus. Brilliant, mate. Lovely. I really want to get him some shoes as well. Everyone who's not got shoes on is stressing me out quite badly. That's the guy who, yeah, fell out the locker. Uh, my darling... Oh, no, no, sorry. You're not my fiancé. You're my brother's fiancé. Get it right, bitch. Okay, I'm going in here. I'm not looking forward to this. I know the nurse is here somewhere. She's in the fucking trailers. So... Where is she? Here, come check this out. Look. Down there. What? Where? Looks like the engine room. Good place to find oh. the generator, right? <sighs> the ladder's broken off here. Great. I think I can just... Wait! <sighs> you Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> all good. Just come down. Will you catch me? So I'm seeing things, but you're not. Okay, so follow Come me. On, Come we on, Brad. Come on, Brad. This ship was carrying Manchurian gold, which we go. was actually some kind of dangerous chemical, right? There and it there's is. There's like weird fog everywhere, all over the place. Maybe that's the Manchurian gold. And maybe it's fucking us all up, like in the head, you know? I mean, I definitely saw some crazy shit that I could have sworn was real, but maybe it wasn't. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. None of it happened. None of it was real. It was just a hallucination. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I mean, maybe there was a connection. Maybe they made contact. It's a theory, I guess. Yep. Oh, yep. God. All right, let's get going. So, yeah, there's a fair point here. That's an awful long half-life for that get for the stuff. Yes, it is. Absolutely agree on that. Also... You could also have the final fucking twist. Yeah, the twist that's following this. We're like... Because it is shorter than a conventional game length anyway. So it could finish sooner. But I think it's more likely the twist is going to be some mad shit like... Because of how many people died to the Manchurian gold, there are ghosts here. You know? Like, it worries me. A lot. Hello. Rotterdam. Oh, Rotterdam or anywhere. Netherlands or Rome. From 1920. Anywhere but home. You know what I miss right now? Dry clothes? Yeah. Shoes? Alright, this is a bad idea. I, don't, I came right. I came round here because I thought there might be something. Now I'm really regretting all of this. Oh my god, hello? Nope, it's a vent. There's nothing here. Motherfuckers. Uh. <laughs> uh. 
Sorry, is that a knife? Hey, hey, I found it. Oh no, it's a oh, switch. Thank God. And it's working. I. Mm. Yeah, this is it, all right. Just throw the switch and let's get back upstairs. Okay, let's get back upstairs. There's got to be another way up. <laughs> lost power, but we have it back. Can you hear me? Over. Nobody's here. Oh. Over. Hello. We need help now. There are things on the ship that are trying to hurt us. Over. Recovery mission is on route to your location. Over. Location is confirmed. Is it? Oh, come on. Work them in. Is that or is it ghost men going, we're coming? I don't know. That's not how rescues typically work. No, like, we didn't give them bearings. Or I thought the bearings didn't come through the last time we chatted to them. So, I don't fucking trust that at all. There was a, uh, there was a door back here I just want to check before we go in. I feel like, yeah, I feel like that's the transition log from the plane. And it's the ghosts talking to us versus uh, modern day people right now. I don't really know where I'm going. I just was trying to find there was a, a spare door, I thought, but apparently not. Oh, hello. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Engine room telegraph log. Here. Oh, God. Here we go. Right. Oh, no. What is this? Do, 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 do. None of this stuff, like that's none of that's out of order. That's all general record. Oh, look at this. Order received to anchor. Anchored in shallow water in the middle of the Pacific, which is where we're at right now. So someone ordered the ship to be anchored. Potentially before everyone tripped balls, but God knows. Um, is it down here? There was a door. Oh, fuck it. I'm just going to go through that other door that we know was there. Fuck it. Julia, I've stopped giving a shit. Let's just go. Come on, Julia. Get out of here. Where is this nurse? I know she's about. I just don't, I don't want to meet her. I really don't want to meet her, but it's coming. You put it in the fucking c uh, cinematic trailer for nothing. The rebreather. So, no, hang on a minute. The fisherman must have brought it over from the Duke of Milan. You think it still works? No, Looks hang like on, when? A juice left. When? Maybe a couple of minutes? When we did they do that? Us? I mean, it's heavy. No, no, no. When did they bring that? We never saw them do that. Conrad, oh my god, what if it's Conrad? Conrad's like next level James Bonded himself onto the ship using a rebreather. Could be. Could be. Also, who sees the nurse? I want to say in uh, cinematics, I have seen Brad see her. Doesn't mean that that's what it is in the game. Just going to slow us down. Take it, take it. Are you crazy? Half the ship is submerged. It could be a lifesaver. It's too new looking, but is it imaginary? This is my worry. Or no. Tell me where the fucking gold is. He's gonna kill him. Oh no, Danny! Also, the lip syncing's going a bit out. So about the loading times are not great. Dude.
Oh. Oh. Oh god. There's the gas! The gas is coming through the vents, dude! You're standing next to it! Oh lord! Gassy boy. Oh, there's the sledgehammer. Oh, fuck. Dude, I would not stand there. I would arguably not go... Oh, shit! Okay. Oh, fuck! I thought I had that, but I was slightly delayed. Shit. Partially because of the frame rate dropping. I mean, what the fuck? But okay. It's fine. This is fine. This is not fine. I'm not entirely sure what's going on with this lag. Because it was fine. It was fine before I played it. Apart from it just loading What's stuff the in. With sharing all that gold, eh? There is no gold! There's no gold, Olsen! <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. Alright. Okay. 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 Then I'm to be left here to die. But I am the captain. I am in control. I am the one that says who goes. Where's the subtitles for him, by the way? He's breathing down our necks. Please tell me you have an escape plan. Uh, we can't risk moving. We can't risk moving yet. Just need to watch and wait for an opening. Shut the fuck up! Oh fuck. Oh, honey, man, do that. Come up short. The generators are on. The gold is mine. And now I'm the one who gets to <laughs> Me! With my big fucking armor! Okay, dude! You had a great time! Ah, <laughs> oh, shit! No! Run! God, that's hard. That's really hard. Holy shit. Oh. Oh no. Yes. It stunned him briefly. <laughs> oh no. Uh, he's just... It, just shut it. There we go. Lock it. Oh my god. Lock it. Are we safe? Please tell me we're safe. I don't know. Yeah, totally. I mean, these doors were invented with stand all sorts of stuff. Ah! Okay. Oh! Okay. okay. None of you move. None of you go all changing on me now. Oh. All right, Julia, 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 Julia. Slow. Real slow. Julia. Okay. All right. Not changing. None of that. Raise your hands up. Slow. All right, bud. No, no. Not like that. You know what? We don't I know what. Said, no changing. Buddy, we can't see what you're saying. Just put the gun down. Nobody has to get hurt. You think I wanted to hurt anybody? I didn't get a choice in this, did I? It's in you too, isn't it? Isn't it now? I did the bet the... Oh, buddy, please. Ha! But again! It's all gone changing on me! What? What's changing? Stay away! Stay back from the mist! Yep. What? There's no mist, man! Don't the, the mist behind us! He's gone! The mist. I saw you, creator! Curator. Uh, why can't we breathe the mist? Why can't we breathe the mist? What does it do? Junior knows. It's life. Bringing things to life that shouldn't be alive. Okay, maybe not it's quite. Inside now. Inside with us now. Please just calm down. Stop. Oi. Stop. Oi. It's in one of us, isn't it? It's in all of us, buddy. Just calm down. Put the gun down now. Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you yep. breathed in the mist. It's happening. I can feel it. Junior. 
Okay, all, all right, look, I, I, there was, you know, something back there. Uh, maybe a mist or a fog, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No. Uh, no. No, look, we held our breath. We did not breathe any of that stuff. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? <laughs> We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. Uh, you're holding your breath right now. Oh, good. Uh oh. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? Oh, God. Julia, no! Julia, 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 Come on, Julia. Come on, Julia. I can feel it swirling around in there. It's changing me. No! Inside. Oh god. Oh, Julia! Julia! Uh, come on, buddy! Come on! You don't deserve to die! Oh, fuck! Oh my god, oh my god, is he okay? Oh no! Now I'm gonna fight with him! Oh, fuck! No, Julia! Come on! No. Dude. Hey, man, come on! Just put the. Oh, mate! Oh, fucking shit. Fucking tried. Maybe the diving gear would have saved him because he could have breathed in air. Shit. Maybe. Shit. We have we have got a gun now though, so because you know a gun in a battleship is a great <laughs> idea. Fuck, Junior, please. I mean, he was one of the pirates that tried to kidnap and kill us, so you know. But. Damn. All right. Wait by the radio. Why? I'm gonna check the next level. There might be some more gear down there we can use. Uh, I don't think so. I'm not so. going far. Just wait by the radio. This is a stupid idea, but fine. Also, the gas won't be flammable because the gas was clearly there and Junior shot. So that answers that question. Besides, Alex is a stupid idea, I agree. There's a lot of, like, bravado and, quite frankly, oh, fucking hell. Ah! Fucking hell, are you serious? That is near impossible to do with the frame rate shit I'm getting from loading in. Come here. This is not great. Please, guys. Like that. I, I thought this the, was patched, but guy. no. He had the distributor cap. Are you? Ah, oh, Ninja Beast there. He's fucking there. It's gone. Oh fuck, the scene changed, but literally he was there. Fucking curator at the end of the hall. Piece of shit. Ninja Assassin, thank you for the eight months. What have you come to? Go shit. Uh, the game's coming out tomorrow, so we already have early access uh, because of code. Thank you. Um, yeah. Literally, every single every single thing I've managed to fail because of frame rate. I really hope this is being patched. I was told that there was going to be a patch when I installed it, which I have downloaded. That does not seem to be uh, dealing with some of the frame rate stuff, which is a bit of a concern um, because this is effectively a brand new Xbox One X and it's clunking. Um, Control also clunked really heavily, so I think it's just more early releases than anything else. Um, it's not a huge pain in the ass, because I'm going to replay the fuck out of it, and I'm enjoying them. But um, it's really hard to hit timed events when they're not actually, like, when they kind of freeze on you. Anyway, it's not the end of the world. We'll just play through. Right. Okay, so uh, there's a bit of mist on the floor, just uh, that like nice, oh fuck, it's like green hue, greeny yellow hue. Fucking hell. Ah! Oh! Alright, Olsen. The Olsen twins. I haven't seen any pictures for a while either. This must have been what we just heard. Uh, what he smashed a door through. Oh no, what's that? That's Junior dying, right? Matter. 
we need that distributor cap. Yeah. Here, he had to have come this way. I like how he's got shoes, and that's it. Holy crap. What? Look at that shit. What? What? Oh, the hole in the floor. Sorry, yes. Uh. Uh, uh, no, hang on. Oh, oh lord, hello. No, I do not. You can't fucking make that. Oh, fuck me. Are you shitting me? Come on now. Like, Jesus Christ. I tell you what, if you've got mobility issues, you may. You ain't making that. I just hit A. I just fucking hit A, and you told me I failed that. Are you shitting me? I mean, we're gonna get across, maybe, hopefully. But, like, I definitely hit that. Oh. Oh. Boy. Oh, good! Great! Brilliant! Also, one of us is across, the other is not now. And he's pissing around in the toilets, the medical bay. He's dropped the sledgehammer. Would it help to reset the Xbox? I doubt it, since uh, this was not an issue until I loaded the game. Unfortunately. Oh, no! No, he's dying! Dude, that's quite a quick death. I'm not gonna make this jump, Alex. I'll have to find another way around. Oh, shit. All right, bye. Fuck's sake. Okay, well, it's just me and the gap uh, of Rohan and also the galley. I don't like that we've been near the sick bay and the nurse has not appeared. That really upsets me because it means she's somewhere. But they know. They know what they're doing. They know all this stuff. Uh, what the fuck, dude? I swear to God. Are you shitting me? Is this the, ga the galley? Oh, God. Uh, Harold Tom Walter. Military intelligence indicated that Sergeant Jones of five of his platoon have gone missing during a recon mission at the water purification plant. Unable to make contact, situation is grave. Don't know if they're captured or alive. Then they went silent approaching the plant. The plant has high security. They're expecting you. They will restrict your movement, so it may prove difficult to look for Jones. Primary objective is clear. Secondary objective when you reach your destination is to locate Jones and the men and bring them home. Be very vigilant. A general sent this. So that's the like, can you go and uh, can you go and find the Manchurian gold and such? Uh, that's a rat eating. Oh no, the rats! Oh rats, please! Rats, that's bad for you. You're eating gas stuff. Also, the the literally it's on his chest. Sometimes you just get lucky. You wish you got fucking lucky. God, the rats are gonna fucking eat me. It's gonna eat me! Oh my god. Oh, dude, really? You didn't need to do that. There are only rats. God damn, man. No! Oh! Fuck off. Oh shit! I swear to God! Fuck off! Dude, get out of there! 
You've angered the plague tail rats. Hugo is not here. No, no, no. You don't need to stab them. They're not. Uh, no, dude. Just. Oh my god. Are you serious? You. Are you fucking? Are you fucking serious? <laughs> Is that a double head? It is it a double head? Fuck me. <laughs> All I was going to do was go like, you've literally left the distributor cap in the play. Like, you put it down, picked up the knife and ran. We have to go back. <laughs> but now this thing's here. Fuck off. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> no. Uh, what is this? Um, hello? Whoa, what the fuck are you? Punch it. Punch it in the fa- No, no, don't punch it. Don't stab it. Oh god. Oh god. Uh What if it's what if it's our brother? <laughs> I mean, fuck me! <laughs> oh shit! Get it! Uh neither! Neither, 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 due to it, due to, punch it! Just punch, it's not there, it's not there, it's not there, it's Fliss! It's Fliss! It's okay. Whew. Okay. Oh my god, Fliss. That was a good call. We always stabbed Fliss or ourselves there. <laughs> it definitely wasn't because I accidentally missed trying to hit Fliss. <laughs> I panicked. Oh, uh, I panicked. Uh, I mean, I didn't want to stab myself. With, that clearly was what it's going to do. And then I was like, do we, do we, no. Because we know that's... Oh, daytime. We know that that's, yeah, a lie. We've got the distributor. Do we now leave? Can we now leave? Oh, hello. What the fuck? Did we do it? Are we done? No, no, this is too chill. This is not how horror, horror films and shit work. All right. Let's try it. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Hang on. Oh, shit. Thank you very much, Jay Android, for the bit. Have I saved them? Have I saved them? Why is it loading? What is happening? Oh no! I just want to know what happened to my brother. He was trying to help us to, to get help, but yeah, comrade. He doesn't know anything about boats or sailing. I just hope he's alive. That he's okay. <laughs> we should have never split up. <laughs> oh, hello. Frame ratey, please. That was particularly bad. If that's the last scene, I'm gonna piss myself. No! Oh my god! Oh my god, he's alive. Is he alive? Bitch, don't fucking eat my head. Oh no, he's not! He's very much dead! No! Conrad, why? I'm so sorry. I failed you. <sighs> Mate, that's fucking grim. It is but a flesh wound. Shit me! That's it. It's that. It's our attempt at Madame Madan. But we can play it again. Oh, there he is. Hello. Right? 
Oh god. Are you judging me? Please, don't judge me. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. Oh no. You could always try again. See if you can't do better next time around. Impressive. Almost everyone survived. Almost. <laughs> I'll do better next. Things became a little intense, time. but Alex kept his nerve. Well done, Alex. Well done, you. Yay! It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Oh, wow. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. <laughs> I killed Bobby Iceman. I'm sorry, Jake the Animorph. I'm so sorry. Till we meet again. Oh, God. Maybe in Little Hope, maybe somewhere else. But be certain, we will meet again. It's inevitable. <laughs> Alright, mate. Bye. God damn. Little hope. Want to spare me over till another year. Want to spare me over till another year. Want to spare me over till another year. Want to spare me over till Oh my god, there's so many versions. That's ridiculous. I think next hope. Could be wrong, but we know that there is a Blair Witchy styly in the woods coming. Not necessarily like Blair Witch, Blair Witch, but we know there's one base of the woods that could be Little Hope. They could be doing a culty, outlasty one. Oh my god, hello. Is that Danny? Oh, oh shit, is Danny? Has they left Danny on the boat? Oh no. Danny? Danny! I'm sorry, Danny. Oh, shit! Danny! This Danny's gonna be saved! Or is he? I bet Danny runs at them with a knife and they just shoot him. So oh. out of nowhere, this thing just sent out an SOS. Guess we got a real life ghost ship here, huh? Oh, fucking hell. Oh, lads. This is just gonna be cyclic, isn't it? And the beat goes up. Whoa. What the hell is this? I caused. I did this. I did this! <laughs> I contacted them! I made this mistake! I'm surprised that there wasn't any information for them, you know. Lads, lads, what are you do lads, lads, I don't do I need to do anything? Should I just watch you like die? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh no! <laughs> Daddy, no! Daddy killed the men! Oh daddy, why? Poor Danny. I mean, I'm kind of glad that Danny didn't die, but Danny's definitely dead now. So there we go. Let's put a look at Madame Uh Next one, no idea when it is. Rumours already circulating that it's a woods-based one. Um, what I would say is if you've been watching this, yeah, frame rate wise this is before the day one patch comes out. As far as I'm aware, they do say there's a day one patch, but I'm pretty sure that it's not available to me right now. Um the day before it comes out so uh bear that in mind i am going to play more of it we're definitely on twitch we'll try and do some like shared story shit uh if i can uh at the very least i'm going to play movie night at home with friends um but i would recommend this you've barely seen half of it like at least the first three hours i'm very aware that there is a separate narrative that runs in parallel because as i said before player A and player B see different things and it looks like the single player the first story time round you'll do that you miss an entire Conrad bit there's so many bits that we've missed basically so um, yeah I would recommend picking it up yourself playing it maybe get your friends around have some pizza 
have a nice time. Uh, I've, I, I'm excited for Sabal. I'm excited for, yeah, more curator. This guy's great as well. Uh, so thank you very much uh, to uh, Badly Lab Co, Supermassive Games for the code. And I look forward to the next one, guys. Like, you've nailed it. Um, so thank you. Uh, if you're watching this on YouTube, give it a thumbs up. Uh, let me know what you thought. Uh, and if you've been playing it, the other options that have happened with you. And I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.